In just hours, Vice President Mike Pence will be in Florida to get an up-close look at some of the damage caused by Hurricane Michael. Mr. Pence, along with Governor Scott, will visit Tyndall Air Force Base, which was heavily damaged during the storm. The governor has already asked the president for resources to help rebuild. And of course, Tyndall is just one of the many areas in the panhandle wiped out by the storm. And some of those impacted are now getting some extra help thanks to our very own Trooper Steve. He is in Gulf County this morning along with other members of the Highway Patrol and some church volunteers. We want to check back in with him live now. So Steve, already you guys are getting results. That's right, Kirsten. You know, yesterday was a pretty difficult day for a lot of members of Gulf County as they had to prepare for a funeral. And being here yesterday, also seeing this, I lived here, I was a Mexico Beach police officer, and that's where I started everything. The damage here, you can't, you really can't describe it unless you're out here on the ground. And you've got units from all over Central Florida that are here right now just a second ago we had about 15 duke energy vehicles go by with the orange county sheriff's office so the need and the want to help is here i had the opportunity to speak with chief domino yesterday who kind of described his emotional roller coaster that he's going through today we started by burying one of our brothers he, he got killed in a uh, tree fell on him as he was as he was trying to clear some property for some people He's, uh, he was actually our fire commander for this county and a good friend. Um, and we, we had to lay him to rest this morning. It's hard, you know, hard to let him go. So it's been a hard morning. But when Denise called us and said people were coming, you know, it, it lifts your spirit to know that somebody else is thinking about you. Some powerful words from a fire chief of a community in need. And you can see just by what you're looking at there, this damage out here, this entire area is just devastated and the need is there. And that's when the Central Florida community really came through with Rethink Life Church. And when we pulled up and seeing that little glimmer and that smile in chief's face really just motivated us to know what we were doing is, is is appreciated out here and the central florida community is really is really kind of showing off in the panhandle and that's hey orlando strong is kind of what we're known for and we need to kind of spread that across the rest of central florida now of course i'm going to be out here the next couple of days and you can keep up with me here and over at clickorlando.com trooper steve from port st joe guys back to you thank you steve